Elephants have long been known to be among the most intelligent animals on our planet. Numerous studies have shown them to have problem-solving skills, individually and cooperatively, the ability to use tools, and to communicate within a complex social structure. Additionally, they've demonstrated a range of behaviors like altruism, empathy, happiness, fear and grief. But why sometimes elephants get suddenly angry on humans? And what is best to do in case you are facing an angered elephant ready to charge right at you? To find answers to these questions and many more interesting stuff related to elephants, stay tuned! Elephants are the world's largest land animals. Not only can elephants grow as large as about 4 meters tall and weigh as much as about 6 tons, but they can run 40 to 45 kilometers an hour. Elephants are famous for their incredible memories and their superior intelligence. In addition though, they have also become notorious for their violent rage and sometimes fatal outbursts. Their strength and affinity for rage make elephants one of the most potentially dangerous animals in the world. When humans and wildlife are forced to live side by side, conflict is inevitable. Human-elephant conflict is increasing due to ever-increasing human habitations encroaching on the forest lands, forest fires destroying habitats, invasives reducing the amount of food available for elephants, increased exploitation of forests, and the cultivation of species preferred by elephants like paddy or banana close to the forest and elephant corridors. Elephants are the world's largest vegetarians and the food is at the root of many elephant conflicts. An adult elephant may eat over 200 kilograms a day. A herd can consume an entire field in one night. Fences and other deterrents are often useless against hungry herds. Sometimes they will enter villages and destroy huts and houses if they smell food. When there are retaliatory actions from the villagers, the elephants will usually deliver rage or fear driven strikes against those villages. Elephants have a memory that rivals almost all other creatures. They have been known to remember those that have hurt them or helped them years after the fact. After extended periods of poaching and culling in 1970s and 1980s, elephants suffer post-traumatic stress disorder from witnessing the slaughter of their families and young ones. Another effect that these killings had on the herds belonged from the fact that hunters would often kill the oldest and largest elephants, those that would usually take the lead in the herd. This meant that more inexperienced teenagers were forced to look after themselves without the guidance of an experienced animal. This led to a delinquent generation of elephants with gangs of aggressive young males with an appetite for violence towards each other and other species. If an elephant has a bad experience with people, his behavior will be adjusted accordingly either more fearful or more aggressive depending upon his own personality. Other members of the family will follow the lead of an older female during moments of crisis and younger elephants will learn how to act. Aggressive behavior toward people can be learned. Just as children learn prejudices from their parents, so too do elephants. It has been observed that in Kenya, the elephants are fearful or aggressive toward Maasai tribe, but not toward tourists. This is because people from this tribe were hunting elephants for a long time. Another reason that males become particularly aggressive and violent is their state of must. This word is actually Hindi for madness, and is a periodic state at which testosterone levels in an elephant can be on average 60 times greater than in the same elephant at other times. Scientific investigation of must is problematic because even the most placid elephants become highly violent toward humans and other elephants during must. Most cases of elephants attacking their handlers or reports of a rogue wild elephant running wild through villages is during must, when they get out of control and their level of aggression is high. There is a 3 weeks pre-mast condition, about 1 month high mast, and 1 post-mast condition. 
The reason for the mast seems to be that it prevents inbreeding. The older females in a herd gives passage to mast males when a female is in heat, while they block the way for younger males not in mast. If the bulls would not be at their aggressive peak only for a month or year, only the largest, most dominant bull would mate all the time. Recently, it was discovered that long-term administration of luprolite acetate reduces the mast. Early mast signs ceased within 3 days of drug administration after 10 of 12 injections. A solution where our villages too close to forests where elephants are living is the construction of an electric fence between them. When the wires with electricity pulses of up to 9000 volts drawn from solar powered energizers are touched by an elephant on the soft flesh of its chest or its trunk, the animal is shocked and forced to turn away before it can reach the posts to destroy the fence and run into the fields. The fence voltage is high, but the current is low, meaning that it cannot kill anybody. The fence must also be maintained where it is damaged to keep it effective because elephants learn fast where fences are no longer electrified, taking advantage. If you come face to face with an angry elephant, you'll need to know how to avoid being hurt. Fortunately, most elephant charges are just mock charges meant to frighten you but not harm you. Do not show your back to the elephant during a mock charge. The elephant will see this behavior as fearful and submissive and will be inclined to chase after you and hunt you down. If facing down a charging, angry elephant, your best bet is to shout, yell and make as much noise as you can. To avoid being discovered by an elephant, you should know that elephants have a keen sense of smell. This means that the wind should be blowing past the elephant towards you, not past you towards the elephant. When you're downwind, the elephant will find it difficult to smell you and seek you out. If you are far enough from a charging elephant, try to run in a zigzag pattern. A charging elephant can run much faster than you, but if you zigzag, elephants find it difficult to change directions due to their bulky size. Elephants have poor eyesight, so this means you might escape if you can reach cover. There are also accounts of people confusing charging elephants by dropping articles of clothing and other items. Sometimes the elephant will attack the clothing instead of the person, which can at least buy you a little time. Many people have saved themselves by climbing trees. Just remember how powerful an elephant is. They have been known to knock over small and even mid-sized trees to get at people in them. Like humans, elephants experience frustration and anger for a variety of reasons. It's important for us to understand their behavior and to respect these admirable creatures. I hope you enjoyed our video. If you want to see more interesting videos, help our channel to grow by pressing the like button and share our videos with your friends. And if you are the first time here, don't forget to subscribe.